thanks for that kind introduction. I know you said at the outset that uh, being Secretary of Defense has never been easy. Leon Panetta and Mark Esper said it was easy on their watch. I don't see what the problem is. Over the long sweep of American history, the cost of courage has always been dwarfed by the cost of cowardice. And the cost of abdication has always far outweighed the cost of leadership. The world will only become more dangerous if tyrants and terrorists believe that they can get away with wholesale aggression and mass slaughter. You know, in every generation, some Americans prefer isolation to engagement. And they try to pull up the drawbridge. They try to kick loose the cornerstone of American leadership. And they try to undermine the security architecture that has produced decades of prosperity without great power war. And you'll hear some people try to brand an American retreat from responsibility as bold new leadership. So when you hear that, make no mistake, it is not bold, it is not new, and it is not leadership. Let me urge you to pass a full year appropriation. That's the single best thing that Congress can do to strengthen our national defense. You know, our competitors don't have to operate under continuing resolutions. And so doing so erodes both our security and our ability to compete. And I also urge you to pass our urgent supplemental budget request to help fund our national security needs, to stand by our partners in danger, and to invest in our defense industrial base.